Hello there. I'm Al Pectore, and today we're going on an adventure. for a wild creature. This one is ferocious. It's huge. Okay, now, come on. Ah, oh, there it is. There it is, look at it. It's a wild big bird in its natural habitat. Look at it. Look at it. It's just looking for its next prey. Now, let's see if I can get a little closer and try to, you know, touch it. These things are dangerous. Oh my! Now look, this is wild, Mr. Keith. All it does all day is sit on its phone and stare at Instagram. Now, they are very, very protective of the young. Okay? And its young is called a Timmy. Oh, it's getting mad! Keep running! Run away! Run! Run! I knew I'm for attacking! <laughs> I think I have a creature. <laughs> Alright, so now we're gonna go in and we're gonna look for a wild Kermit. Oh my god, look! The creature's back! It looks to be migrating to a new area. Let's go look at it, come on. Stop trying to hog the computer, Look at it. It seems to be trying to create a, a fight with another creature. But the other creature's not looking. I don't think it noticed yet. What are you doing there? Three. Oh, he noticed the conflict. <laughs> there might be a fight, so I need to keep going. Come on. Okay, now we're looking for a wild camera the frog. These Three. things are really, really hard Cut. to find. <laughs> now, where is it? I mean, look, I like to hide in high places. Oh, look! It's right there! They're very peaceful creatures. Now, let's see if I can get close enough to touch it. Elegant creatures. another aggressive creature. These things stay inside of their little habitat all day, only coming out to hunt for new prey. Now this is where they're supposed to be. Come on, look. Ah, it's not home. Looks like we're gonna have to find it later. We can see it feasting on detention slips. All right, let's keep going. Yeah, I heard about you. Ah, look. Yeah. It's there. Why are you filming me? Now, these are aggressive creatures, so we're gonna have to walk away slowly. Don't make any eye contact. You're making a lot of eye contact. Don't, don't look at it. All right, just keep going. But I'm looking at you. Now, we're gonna find one of the most impressive creatures in the whole outback. These are called the Royal Cagneys. Now let's come in very slowly and quietly. Look at it. Now these things are very, very peaceful. As long as you leave them alone. Look at its magnificence. Now, I'm gonna try to see if I can get close enough to touch it. It doesn't like to be tough, so we're gonna keep going. Look, another wild creature. Let's see if I can get close enough to touch this one. Quite 
Like the joyous creature. <laughs> it I likes like to Now, in this room right here, there's a whole pack of students working diligently on their craft. Let's just take a look. We don't want to disturb them. Look at them. Magnificent creatures, aren't they? Now, here comes behind us a wild Johnny Locust. We have to be careful that we cannot be seen by other dangerous creatures. Now, where we're going right now is to find one of those wild goats that wander around the building. These wild goats are truly, truly extraordinary creatures. Look upon it. In its natural habitat, we don't want to be seen just yet. Now, we are going to look and see if we can make contact with this special creature. Look at it. This is the closest I've ever been to one of these goats. Creature. Oh, I didn't see you here. It speaks! Oh my goodness! Oh my gosh. Okay. Now let's see if I can touch this creature. It, it seems to be very shy. Oh, I'm shy. He's shy. Now let's try this again. Nope, nope, okay. We're gonna get out of here. Alright, now we're gonna look to see if we can find one of them wild cobras. Now, these cobras are vicious creatures, if they are provoked. They love to be close with their family, and they're very protective of their cubs. Now, let's, let's see if we can see a wild cobra. Oh, look. This one right there. It's a wild cobra. There it is. Magnificent creature. It seems to have noticed us. Oh no, he's angry. Let's, let's keep walking, let's keep walking. Alright, now we're gonna see if we can find a wild bedroom. Now, these creatures, like the cobras, are very protective of their cubs. They like to stay secluded in their habitat. But they can be lured out if you bait them with their favorite things. Mathematics. Alright. It likes to be in the dark, so we're gonna try to pass through very secretly. And it wasn't just a question of tradition. These creatures you ever found are very, very seclusive, so we're gonna have to be very careful when we come upon them. Many, many in the so every time I find myself in a new town, it's usually kind of a confrontation. I have to so we're going to have to bait it, see if it likes it. Basically, an animus with counters instead of beads. The menu of the beads bankers had to swear an oath. Let's try again. <laughs> We found it again. This time, it's branching out, probably looking for food. It's trying to make an escape. To avoid danger, we're gonna walk away too. Okay, come on. Now, where we're gonna go next is another creature that is not from here. But this creature is known for its kindness and caring attitude. Now. Let's try to get inside. The habitat is very hard to get into. So we're gonna try one of the mating calls to get in. I think they're a bit confused. Oh, here comes one. It's scared. It opened the door. Okay, look, come on. She seems to be in the middle of something. Look! 
This creature is especially dangerous because oh, it has a temper. Now, where we're about to go next is in the far corners of the outback. In here lies a creature that makes noises that not even mankind can decipher. But to some and many, there are noises of beautiful capacity. Okay. Now look at it. It seems to be teaching its flock. Now, let's see if we can make contact with this creature. It does not want us. It is very dangerous. we're about to go next is in the lowest, lowest parts of this here outback. And here we find some of the most mature creatures to walk these plains. Look! <laughs> it's a wild woods. These things are dangerous. If they feel provoked, they will attack. So that's why you have to attack first! <laughs> now, we have a royal Lindsay. These creatures are another one who, if I could use some my words, are very irritable. So, we will not try to provoke this creature. We're being followed! specimen that I was just talking about. Now, let's see if this creature likes to be touched. Wait, opening our doors. It's dangerous. It's a wild mica. We have to catch it. It's a speedy creature. How am I ever going to catch that? Looks like you'll find out in the next episode. Alright, now we're gonna look to see if we can find a wild cobra. Now, these wild crow cobra. <laughs>